Ladies and gentlemen, referee Kerry Hatley has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 29 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO, Jared the Killer Gorilla. I'm with Jared Cannonier. Jared, it didn't start great. Did you know you would have to go through that type of first round, him taking you down, having to survive to get the finish that you were looking for? Man, if anybody knows my career at middleweight, they know that's how, usually how it's gonna go, especially with a high-level wrestler like Derek. I never did discount his wrestling. I always said that that's his best chance of winning, and uh, I wouldn't call it adversity. It's just uh, going through the motions, if you will. You guys were in close in the clinch. You landed a nasty elbow that hurt Derek really, really bad. And once you saw that you had him hurt, you jumped on him and you recognized that a finish was in order and you went and you got it. It wasn't just the elbow, it was that nice little backhand. I keep telling people, you get in my face with that disrespect, you're gonna catch the backhand. You come, you come running up in my face, I'm gonna bust you in yours and that's exactly what I did. I turned Blonde Brunson into Blood Brunson like I said I was gonna do. It went down in H-Town, you know what I'm saying? So, Brother Jared, you have now just won what seems to be a number one contender's fight. The middleweight championship is on the line in a matter of minutes. What is next for Jared Cannonier? Well, I want to say this while looking Dana in his eye. Hey, Dana! Dana, look at me! Hey! Quit distracting Dana! Get Dana! Get him! Get him! Dana, I want that shot next! I get the shot next! It's me! Nobody else! Me! Okay? All right! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the killer gorilla, Jared Cannonier!